Ladies and gentlemen, we are talking all things Dark Universe at Universal Studios Orlando Resort. Yes, you are. You're seeing that. You're seeing that right. We are talking about something that is inside of a theme park that is outside of haunt season, and that is the dark universe over at Universal Studios Orlando. I'm your host, Anthony, and today uh, we got a bunch of announcements about all the themed lands we are going to be expected to see in Epic Universe following lands such as uh, Celestial Park, the Wizarding World of Harry Potter, Ministry of Magic. Very excited for that. Uh, Super Nintendo World, How to Train Your Dragon, Isle of Burke, and of course, the dark universe. Today, I'm I'm going to talk about the dark universe and also talk about another uh project that universal has releasing next year as well that has something to do to kind of tie in with that uh, and and how they're kind of changing the horror and haunt game uh just year round so let's let's start about uh let's talk about dark universe i have the article here from bloody disgusting and uh it goes as follows the dark universe is said to be an ominous and chilling experience one that will reimagine universal's classic monsters from the experiments of Dr. Victoria Frankenstein to a shadowy landscape where monsters roam, Dark Universe is a world of myth and mystery. I'm super excited for this, number one. Uh, as you see in the concept art, we have a, a few things here uh, to note. Number one, Frankenstein's castle. Uh, I think it looks phenomenal. If they're going to make that like very dark and, and, and ominous and everything, I think the best time, uh, you know, just kind of looking at this, I think the best time would probably be like at night to go experience this. Um, just in the sense that, you know, they, they you want to get that the, the best feeling out of it, the best illusion out of it. And I think the nighttime would be the best time to go see that. I don't know much about what you know what piece of land this is building at like I, I have other friends out there lost tv zombie chris uh exploring attractions eddie tame it hollow thrills just to name a few uh <laughs> that will actually be doing way more in-depth coverage of the overall park and everything today i'm just focusing on dark universe um i'm excited for this you got a dark ride that is rumored to be coming uh themed to the universal monsters and dr frankenstein's castle i'm assuming that'd be the best place to put the dark ride and then you got this entranceway that looks really cool it looks like it's taking you into another dimension uh, of the monster world um so i'm super stoked about this to see what characters will actually be walking around for photo ops and how they reimagine these characters looks and everything um and, and what kind of attractions and and like eatery and shops will be in this uh store i guarantee you i will probably spend a lot of money in this land alone buying merchandise as it is but dark universe i i think it's a game changer for the uh theme park industry you've never seen an entire land themed to uh, a horror genre especially the likes of the monsters from universal universal has a very rich history when it comes to the horror genre because they are practically the inventors of the horror genre they uh released the universal monsters at the very beginning and the late 20s uh through the 30s and 40s all the way to the 50s you know the the monster legacy goes on from you know the, the originals to sequels to uh reimaginings it keeps coming back there's someone that always takes on the classic monsters and makes it their own or makes it scarier whatever it is that keeps coming back it's a circle of life with with the universal monsters they're always going to be in history until the to the end of time uh that's just that uh with that though I, I, what i find interesting is this is also opening in 2025 and when i say also there is another project out here on the west coast that is opening in 2025 and that is horror unleashed out, out in las vegas nevada now we are going to vegas out uh in April, at the end of April, April 28th through April 30th, I'll be out there. So I definitely will get some construction footage. I know uh, I've been seeing my friend John from the Haunt Line talk about, obviously, uh, walls have gone up for the uh, Horror Unleashed over there right behind Area 15. So I'm excited to see where they are come time April. That's a little bit further down the line. But this is a huge year for uh, – 2025 is just going to be a huge year for Universal in general. You know, you got the Dark Universe opening up at Epic Universe. You have Horror Unleashed opening out in Las Vegas. You know, more Horror Nights and all that. You know, Universal is really stepping up the horror game and, and really changing – the the scene like drastically like they're making a year-round haunt that is going to cater to the likes of the universal monsters to you know jordan pill films blumhouse films anything universal has done with horror you know that is going to be fun there's going to be constant changes said that 
are going to happen within that in Horror Unleashed over in Las Vegas. And out in Florida now, you have the Dark Universe, uh, a year-round um, attraction uh land I, I think that's a lot of fun i me and hayes were talking about it we already want to try to make a trip to go out there and obviously we'd probably be doing it around halloween time anyway so we could do everything <laughs> i'm talking theme parks i'm talking you know horror nights you know th there's a lot that um i can't wait to see with this and, and universal has been on a roll lately so let's see what they have to bring to the table with the epic universe more specifically the dark universe and horror unleashed I'm rooting for Universal. Been a fan of you guys for as long as I can remember as a kid. Been going to Horror Nights since 2011. Let's see what you guys have to bring to the table. I can't wait to see what you guys do to change the haunt game. But with all that being said, what do you guys think about the Dark Universe coming to Epic Universe and Horror Unleashed out in Las Vegas, Nevada? Leave your comments down below and stay tuned because we're going to give you all the updates to both of these as they uh, break out. I thought I had to make a video of this because I am just so fascinated with this concept and uh, I think it's going to be awesome. But uh, until then, guys, uh, make sure to hit that subscribe button, that bell notification, be aware every time we put up a new video and follow us on all of our social media links. Uh, but with all that being said, until the next one, stay spooky.